Are you tired of your nude lipstick just not working with your skin tone? And it just looks like you woke up and your lips just were so crusty, like to the point where it looks like you have light foundation or concealer on your face. Yes, you, right there. I'm talking to you. Sis, I can help you. You want my help, right? Hello? You want my help? Yes, I can help you. Just keep watching this video and you'll be set, girl. I promise. <laughs> Lex with another video. Uh, Lex with another video. Uh, I'm here with another video. I'm here with another video. Uh, 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 uh. Mm -hmm. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Lexa Marie. You know, bringing you more content, bringing you more video stuff. You know, the vibes, you know, the vibes are ready. Today, you know, I'm rocking the natural hair. We got a new background. Like, we're just, we just keep doing another step and another step and another step. And if you've been here since the beginning, when I was recording on my floor, in my room, you know, I'm still in my room, right? But I got finally got a, um, a paper to put in the background. So, you know, it's looking a little bit more professional, okay? Besides that, today I'm going to be talking about my wonderful lip combinations. Um, a few of you have already asked me about my lip combos. And, you know, it's really hard because I just mix like five colors together sometimes. Or like one color or three colors or 38 colors. And then I just slap it on my lips. And then you're like, oh, what did you use? And I'm just like... Uh... And then give a list like... No, I just thought I should just make a video so you guys know exactly and you are put on by a girl. But before this video, make sure that you subscribe to my channel, <laughs> subscribe, like just support. Like, you know, it, do it doesn't cost anything and actually it helps me. So if you really, you know, want to support and you don't know how, just, you know, just, you see it, you see it. So let's just let's just do that and you know like the video um if you're new please check out my other content after you watch this video and if you're not new then you know hey <laughs> hey girl hey so the first thing that i'm going to do is get rid of whatever's on my lips right now it is really important to take care of your lips if you are wearing matte lip creams or lipstick or whatever if you're someone like me and you just you know have crusty little lips if you have crusty lips you know it's okay you know i'm not judging you but you need to take care of them because you cannot be walking around it's 34 degrees outside and the wind's hitting you and we're just seeing you know a little icicle icicle crust falling from your lips you know what i'm saying i have a nighttime uh lip medical care thing for my lips because my lips is just and um, I put that on my lips before I go to bed. But to remove the makeup that's already on my lips, I'm going to use my Garnier Skin Active uh, Cleansing Water. This is an all-in-one mattifying. I use this for my face, but you know, it doesn't matter. It takes up a lot of makeup, so I'm just gonna use this for my lips today. So I'm not dying. <laughs> and a little bit came off, just a little bit. You see right there and we're about to get started i think it was a football game they were just giving out like free stuff um the right time clinic near my school and i was just like oh you got lip balm let me just take all of them <laughs> so i have a bunch and they work pretty well uh especially if you have you know crusty crusty musty lusties like me before i begin I'm going to be using the most you're probably gonna get a little annoyed because it's mentioned in literally almost all of my combinations it is the NYX liquid suede cream lipstick in the color downtown beauty I don't know why I picked this up one day but I picked it up and I was just like <gasps> literally if you wear it by itself it looks like 
nude nude like a brown nude on my skin but personally I like this to line my lips and then to go in with either a pinkish color nude or a tan um, or ash color nude in the center of my lips so for the first look I'm going to show you something that involves this color and one of my other favorite colors Well, the lippy that I used was by Absolute New York. It's their Velvet Lippy in the color Terracotta. And then I just went around with, again, the brown velvet lipstick with my lip gloss. This is a very peachy color. It's really simple, really easy to do. And um, for beginners, this is something you could do in like five seconds. So for this next look, I'm going to be using, again, my brown liner. And I will be using an actual lipstick by Ruby Kisses in the color brown sugar. This is already breaking. Just a just a disclaimer. This lipstick is already breaking. This, I just got a brand new one and um you know, it's cheap. It's $3. So just get more than one, please. I know the product longevity isn't that great, but the product look is worth it if that makes sense. So let me just show you what I'm talking about. And push out. I personally think this is more on the ashier tan side um I asked someone they said they saw pink and I was just like weird weird this is a very like matte you know pop out I feel type of nude um you can always go over it again if you want to make it more ashy you can I mean I mean, this is, come on now. Who said, who said dark skinned girls can't wear nude? Who? Who? Cause look. I'm wearing it. <laughs> You'll be wearing it. We'll be wearing it. So don't listen to them because look, <laughs> period. But these are the only two lippies that I did use for this look. If you want to add gloss, be my guest, but I feel like this look does not need any gloss at all. For look number three, I'm going to be using three products just to kind of, oh, this broke too. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Oh, it's not broken, <laughs> Never mind. I'm going to be using another Ruby Kisses product. They tend to break really easily, so just another disclaimer, just be aware of that. Handle them with care. This is the Lacy Matte Lipstick in the color Petal Dust that I'll be using, and I'll be mixing this with the Absolute New York Calypso Velvet Lippy.
So I keep moving my camera. I'm sorry if it's ending up in different places, but this is how the color looks. It's more of a pinky color, more of a pinky nude. Again, I feel like this probably would look good with some gloss. What you think? You think I should put gloss on? I'm gonna just try it. I think I'm gonna use, let me see, I might use Madeline or Fortune Cookie. I think Fortune Cookie will make it look more ashy, but Madeline might tone it down. So I'm gonna use NYX Butter Gloss in the color Madeline and just show you how that looks. Ooh. Ooh. I'm gonna do this next time. This is more like a tannish uh, petal color, but this is how it looks. Look at that. Simple. You can always just add a nice pinkish or clear gloss with these combinations that I'm giving you because it just gives it a whole nother like, a whole nother look. Very soft. So for my fourth look, <laughs> This is going back a couple decades, actually three decades to the 90s. I'm going to be using a darker lip for my next look and just try to be a little bit more dramatic. I only do this sometimes, but when I do it, I get a lot of compliments. So hopefully you guys will like it. Right, so this look is very on the pink side and the black liner starts to look a little purple once I mix it in really well with the pink but I love this look I love this look I love this look I love this look I'm gonna add a little gloss oh that's a lot mm -mm. this is show y'all got oh I use so much gloss honey y'all see this Minus the excess gloss. Do you see this? Mmm. 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 That's me flexing on my lips. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> I love this. Look at that. Very 90s. So yes, that is the fourth look, but we're not done here, okay? We have two more looks left, and y'all need to keep watching, you know what I'm saying? Because the last two about to blow your mind, all right? It's about to blow your mind, so just keep watching. Um, if you like this particular look, look number four, please let me know in the comment section down below. I want to know which ones were your favorite looks or combinations, and just get your input. So I know which one to rock on my channel. So for this next look, it's going to be a little bit more simple and a little bit more gloss and light pink. So it's going to be glossy, light pink, whatever. If you do not like this look, you know, you don't have to do it. But on me, I don't mind how it looks. Some people, you know, they're thinking once they put on light, you know, lipstick that they look ashy. Look like, you know, um, Dave Chappelle when he does that, uh, like... What's that? Like that, that druggy scene or whatever? I'm going to put it in the picture. But no, sis, you don't look like that. You're beautiful, okay? So don't be afraid of trying different colors on your skin. Don't be discouraged because you're gorgeous. You're gorgeous, all right? You're gorgeous. So I'm just going to use a colored chestnut by MAC. I don't love this color, but it just looks good with this combination oh, i hate when i do that then i'm gonna go in with fortune cookie that's it mm. ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> so 
So if you don't like how this looks, that's fine. But for me, I'm comfortable with this look. Mm, I might even add like a little bit more of the chestnut color. But this is something like you can kind of just throw together. And once you mix more of it, you'll start to like see it blend and stuff like that. So, you know, don't, don't be afraid. You know, fortune cookie is key. Fortune cookie, I love. I'm telling you, you can't go wrong with these two. You can't go wrong with a cute brown liner and some gloss. So I definitely would recommend this look. It is simple and it's pretty easy to touch up. Just line your lips, gloss them, and head out. This next one, the final one, is one of my, you know, top two, top two, whatever. But it involves gloss. Gloss, gloss. Intense gloss. So if you're not intense, then you might not be able to handle the gloss, all right? You might not be able to handle the gloss and that's okay, you know, too much gloss, like too much. <laughs> yeah, I really need to be stopped, like, I keep making jokes that really are not funny. Like, y'all probably really at home just looking at me like, <laughs> zooming, <laughs> zooming through, but no, seriously, <sighs> I try to be funny. And now I'm just gonna go in with my intense lip polish in the color Nude. This is by Absolute New York. Again, I really do like their intense. I like all of their lip creams, actually. I don't know what's going on with Ruby Kisses right now because I just stocked up and they're breaking on me. Ah! Wait a minute. I'm not done. Shut up. I'm not done. I know you see, I know you look at me like, oh, chill. There we go. You can't handle the sauce. It's all right, it's all right, it's all right, it's all right. <laughs> this is the final one. And you only need these two things. These two things. If you want to put gloss, that's fine. But this does the job. Mm -mm. This is how it looks up close. Look at that. Ignore my crooked teeth. But look, <laughs> but look at that. Mm, 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 mm. My favorite in the whole world. It's so easy. You see my lips? It's so easy. Mm, mm, mm. But back to this look. This is so cute. Like. This is so cute. I might get more of this intense lip color. Just because it smells it smells so good and it goes on so nicely. But oh I love that nude. I love that nude. And then just a little bit more brown. Uh if you don't want to use a uh the suede downtown beauty you can always just use the pencil sometimes i do touch up with the pencil instead of the actual stick just because i have more control but you know i don't really care this this is this is how i like it um let me know what you guys think about number six actually because i was nervous people were gonna say i look ashy or whatever but you know i, I know i look good i just wanted to make sure y'all y'all was liking it too you know what i'm saying so i'm so happy you got to the end of this video thank you so much for watching again this is how the color looks on my lips it is a very it's a true nude it's a true nude but with the dark color mixed with this it's like it's just so nice like it's just so nice you know but I hope that you guys have a wonderful day and that you enjoyed this video and make sure that you subscribe and that you like and that you subscribe and like and like and subscribe and then like and then subscribe because you know that's what you just gotta do. I will see you guys soon and um, thanks for watching this video.